How you doing, everybody? This your boy, Heavy Starch. Um, coming to you with the uh, new uh, demolisher minimization. Okay, as you can see, this is demolisher. You may have seen it other places on Facebook, on my page, or on Instagram. This is the uh, minimized demolisher. Um, pretty much everything is uh, done almost. Got a few bugs to work out. But uh, once I finish it, it'll be uh, up for sale. My usual barrel attachment, which I take the tip off because I hate it. And uh, don't have, doesn't have that bar on the front. Didn't see the need for it. Um, basically, uh, stock motors for now, or may leave them stock. Stock motors, uh, the laser attachment, and uh, the modifications are resistors removed. They need to, but a full rewire. Um, basically stock battery tray. Okay, now when you load the clip, you have a indicator light that lets you know that a uh, clip is inserted. You got the laser sight, uh, press laser sight, so a uh, regular sight on the top. I um, really like this paint job. It's kind of a grayish beige uh, mixture about uh, Krylon, so when you remove the clip, you know, the light turns out so there you go Get the led light uh the batteries are contained inside the blaster uh button cell um so if you want to change you probably have to you know fillet the blaster take it apart but uh pretty much uh i like it like the way it turned out um coming up with some uh new products soon and uh this one i'm kind of proud of this one so i'm doing some new uh strife uh projects coming up within the next month uh just got a order of uh motors so uh got a bunch of 180 motors and uh gonna be setting those up was well, gonna put them in here but then i changed my mind because i didn't really want to cut the stock uh see uh, the motors i got and got like 10 of these you know so basically have to do a little alteration to them. Uh, focus, focus. Yeah. Okay. There you can see. Yeah, 180s. So I got these and uh, they work pretty well. So I'm going to put them in a uh, new Stripe projects. The thing is I wanted to take the Stripe and take it to the next level and uh, do a lot of the different things with it. So uh, a lot of people ask me, why don't I weather my blasters and all that like People will tell you, I don't my blaster look like it's been kicked across the planet or some creature then took it and beat me with it. <laughs> so uh, I don't like scratched up blasters. Plus, I like my paint look fresh, like it just came out the armory. Then you take it to battle. So uh, when I work the bugs out of this, when the bugs are, since I have the switch uh, on the inside, when you insert the clip, you know, indicator light cuts on. So I'm going to have to put a master switch. So in case you leave the clip in, you can at least cut the you know, the light off the LED won't constantly run the battery down. So, um, put a couple of truss fires in this, it'll do things. So, uh, and I basically worked out the kinks, work out the kinks in this one. I'll probably put it up for sale. I'm not sure if this is the stock I'm going to go with this one right here, you know, the, uh, retaliator stock, you know, with the little bars cut down. It looks cool, but mm, kind of plain. So I may come up with something different. I may use the, uh, folding um recon stock and cut it down so it's a little bit more stable so um if i sound kind of jacked up uh it's late at night i'm tired just want to get this video out and let people see this one so this is the uh minimized uh demolisher and on the rail the rail is attached with uh screws now this rail came from the uh parts box from uh airsoft a bunch of airsoft guns and scrap pieces I had. So a lot of people ask me, uh, why don't I use 3D printed pieces? Uh, I don't want to order them. And I'm old school. I still believe in using what you got left over. You got a old Nerf gun with a tack rail, cut it off, use it. You know, I mean, I like using scrap pieces. I mean, I love the 3D printed stuff that Joe Castle came with. You check out his uh, new stuff he's doing to convert your uh, blaster to AK-47 real neat you know so i might order something from him you know because i trust him so um this is heavy starch uh this is the minimized demolisher 
Uh, don't hate, congratulate, send a shout out to Joe Cass, awesomely Nerf, Epic Nerf, Triple B, uh, Rob, um, Nerf Brisbane, uh, everybody else out there. And uh, check out my page, Heavy Starch Workshop, on uh, FB Facebook, and hit me on Instagram. So, uh, like I say, this will be up for sale in the near future so if you're interested you know if you see any of the blasters you're interested you know just you know shoot me a message on facebook and you know work out something so i'm probably gonna have some more surprises for you around the first of next month so uh i like that so this is heavy starch uh don't hate congratulate peace